if I needed to collect a urine sample, I'd obviously need my sample bottle. And I'm also going to need a clamp. So the idea is not to collect the sample from the urine within the bag, but to collect the sample that is flowing through the catheter directly from the bladder. So I would clamp just before the bag. Now, if this catheter had been on the patient a couple of days before, etc., then I would get an alcohol wipe and decontaminate the area first before collecting that sample. And all you're doing is cleaning that for 30 seconds and then collecting your sample after. That's provided you've actually come into contact with the key part and that end is already contaminated. You only need about 10 mils for your urine sample. Then you're going to label it appropriately with the patient's surname, name, date of birth, etc. And all the relevant details that need to go in there. Um, and I would know that this is a catheter specimen, um, the date and the time that the specimen has been collected. Uh, and then send it off to pathology. Having collected my sample, I would then remember to release my clamp because I don't want my patient um, to have a blocked catheter because I've left the clamp in situ.